an ordeal. So Khan and I, we left uh, from Sydney a few days ago now. Uh, we got into uh, Fiji. Um, then we got held up in Fiji, missed a connecting flight, finally got into LA. Then we had to wait. Khan got stuck in customs for like three hours. And then uh, we finally made it from LA to Miami. Here in Miami now, training here at downtown, uh, across with downtown Miami getting ready for the competition tomorrow. Um, we're feeling actually really good, surprisingly. Yeah. Like, we had a pretty like average sleep last night, but then we woke up just feeling good, which is great. Fingers crossed that rolls into the weekend. But um, I think Khan's feeling pretty good, I'm feeling pretty good. Um, Maddie, our ring-in, has come in, but we're actually like, we're so stoked to have him. He can row really well, so I'm banking on him doing more of the rowing. <laughs> I'll do more of the pull-ups, he can do more of the rowing. Just excited for the weekend. Like Miami, big vibes all around. It's buzzing all over the town anyway. So and we we're haven't been here to have a blast. And we haven't been here for like seven years. Yeah. So we're like so pumped to come back. It's been a long time in between. So it's like, let's go. Paulina tends to get stopped along the way because definitely in Mexico she's actually one of the most popular athletes which is kind of cool so a lot of times we're just walking along and um, she'll be stopping and talks to everybody uh, as we're stopping through here. Hey, how you doing man? Hey, how you doing? 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 Of my life and then when I, I turned 13 I met uh, CrossFit and then I started over there and I classificate to the games at the 14 division and then 14, 15, 16, 17 and now uh, this year, 2021, um, I won my first medal, uh, third place of the 16, 17 division and that's the, like, the background I have of gymnastics and then I grew up in here in CrossFit. Well, uh, I feel like more motivated because I am like around really good athletes and people and that's like the motivation I have uh, every day because I saw like Tia or Brooke training and, and I want to like be like her or something like that that uh, makes me like go right um, so originally I think it was Cynthia kind of yeah. um, so uh, Shane and Tia were they traveled to big box CrossFit with Cynthia Becerra is that the mm -hmm. yeah um, and they were talking about kind of what is the creation of like the best CrossFit athlete out there and who could kind of possibly make their way into the elite wave and into um, the CrossFit Games and podium. Um, and I believe Shane said, hey, if you grew up a gymnast, a gymnast and then got into weightlifting, this would be perfect. And that's exactly what uh, Paulina did. And so Cynthia knew Paulina and was like, hey, this would be a really great um, opportunity for Paulina to get um, linked up with a group and organization under Shane and Tia who know, who know how to get to that level. Um, and also being around athletes of that caliber just kind of raises you up a notch. And so um, she introduced Paulina to us and we started talking and kind of just got the ball rolling. It was back around um, it's like April yeah. last year-ish. Mm -hmm. um, so kind of like leading into all the qualifiers and after the qualifiers into the games um, got linked up and started working together. By my face, hey, don't got time to waste, yeah. I don't need permission, I'ma do it all the day, yeah. They just can't believe it, man, that's all they gonna say. See these plays up on my Spotify, that's money in the bank about my face.